hopefully we'll get an opportunity to talk with coach Nick Woodruff have no doubt that uh, he'll he'll try to join his court side is it took a little time for West Alabama to get things rolling but once they did it panned out pretty well for the Tigers coach it's the koala socks brother I don't know if we, you can, we can you hear me. What are we talking about here? I told you I'm going to break out the tiger socks all day long, man. We had it. some issues with the uh, the headsets. I don't know what's going on with that, but yeah, well, it's all right after a win. You it's can have okay, all the issues. We're going to do it, you know. 63, 46. We come into Memphis. We go into the half at break, and it seemed like it took us a little time, even in the second half, to get things going. What was the spark in the second half that that was able to stretch it out for us? Well, I hadn't seen a box, but my guess is they didn't make many threes. I, Ruth, I don't, Ruth Sants went cold after the first half. They didn't make half. a three in the second half. That's the answer. There you go. Um, you know, and a few of the threes in the first half, were, were we were playing zone. But three of his threes in the first half, he was four, he made four. One was in zone. Three were, were two on Thad, one on one D, and one was after an offensive rebound. And so he had 14 of the 28 at the half. And so that was all. It was all about number five That's at right. halftime. And that's all we talked about. You know, we did talk about guys having to step up and make plays. Like, you know, even if they have 28, we, we shot an unbelievably bad percentage in the first half. We shot 38%. We were 2 for 12 from the 3. Like, we're going to have 28 points. If we walk in halftime and Fat has 2 and Coran has 2, we're going to have 28 points. And that and that's what we did. And so, you know, and Justin didn't have a great first half shooting the basketball, and that's why defending is so important. Like, there are nights and there are days where that ball won't go in, and we have to defend at a high level to to, to give us an opportunity in those games, and, and we did that tonight. I mean, holding a team to, what would you say, 48? Yep. 46. 46. That's a, that's a big-time effort by our guys, and um, – and, and really, that was a that 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 final score is not indicate it does not indicate the, the the how close that game really was. It was a, I mean, right? I mean, we we exchanged blows there for a long time, and you know, it just seemed like it took a little time to get into our rhythm. And then you said, uh, you know, five he he goes a little bit cold. You know, we we we've got an answer there, and then we start making some buckets, yep. and then we get some big stops. I mean, it it, it all kind of. It all kind of works out, and you know, at the end of the day, we're going to get a win. That's right. We're going to get an opportunity to enjoy it. We can we can look at it. We can start preparing for Union because I mean, we got our that, hands that, full. The, the Union's not a bad ball club. I mean, they're they're going to have uh, everything that they want. They've Senior got a, night, they're they, going to be jacked. They, they, they've they, got a lot of their their fan base is, yeah. is is there too. I mean, so there's a lot of things. So yeah. you know, what's the message? What's the message tonight going into what we've got to take on Saturday? You just got to keep earning the right to play in big games. This is a huge game that a lot of people look at like, Coach, you're supposed to win. Well, they, that, that is a good ball club. They play a ton of close games. They play a lot of people really, really well. They've won two of their last three. Right. And, you know, we just got to keep earning the right to play in big games. And, you know, there's no bigger one than the one on Saturday. It, the biggest one's always the next one for me, man. I'm, I'm, I mean, we we got to take them one step at a time. I mean, it sounds very yeah. cliche, but there's no bigger game than Union. And if we get that under our belt, then we'll look at the likes of Valdosta that's going to have to come to our place. That's right. Yeah. You know, I mean, we had a long road trip. That 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 swing of games, it was like it was like five games in eight days or some kind of deal like that. It was a, it was it was crazy. I know, you know? I know it. And we've we've down the stretch, we've gone three in a row on the road. And we had two at home, and then here we go. This is the third game in a row on the road. We went to West Georgia. We go to here. We're at Union. We just got to keep battling. We got to keep finding ways to win. Even on our days we don't play well, we've got to keep defending. Got to keep finding ways to win. And this team's doing it. They really are. And it, it's you know, it's not what I'm doing. All I do when the game starts is call timeouts and sub a little bit. It's the it's the players. It's the well, it's it's and, Jake. It's and, Rob. It's those guys. Those guys are doing it. They're doing an unbelievable job. Players are playing really, really well into the scanner report. And, you know, yeah, that, the, the, the play, this is the player's time. The game is the I'm player's time. I'm with it. I'm with it. And I'll tell you, Sloan, sweetheart, you are a hard sleeper, my friend. <laughs> I thought that ball was going to smash right into the her back of her leg, and she's just cutting them down, man, just absolutely cutting them down. But, uh, yeah. Coach, I mean, all kidding aside, congratulations on the Thank win. You. I look Thank forward you. to being in Jackson with you guys on Saturday. Um, 
and, and if the guys continue to each do their little part, that's right. The big parts all that's fall right. into place. Keep eliminating a mistake or two. Keep making a, one more play or two, and this thing can kind of keep on taking care of itself. And and we're just finding ways to win, and that's that's what's so important late in the year. Just making sure you handle business and and keep finding ways to win. Well, so. the Tigers keep finding ways to handle business. And coach, I appreciate your Thank visiting you. with us at halftime, folks. That's your head coach, Nick Woodruff. Happy final. Here in Memphis, Tigers win it 63-46.